Good day, everybody. Ladies and gentlemen, gentlemen and ladies, ladies and gents, I just wanted to take the time, and this is taking the time, to let everybody know that we've started the second round of bringing people into this uh, spot trading thing. And we're able to show them exactly how things go and, you know, to show them in real time. Lord have mercy. Uh, give me one second, ladies and gentlemen. I have to take this. That's my ringtone. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I'm sorry for that. That's just uh, the transportation company letting me know that they will be here shortly to take me away like Calgon. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, it's been a horrific day. I got myself up saying, I'm going to go and go get some water because we have to, we haul our water to this location. I have drinking water, no problem, but I the extra water I haul in a truck that was donated. And I said, I'll wait. And so this morning I got up and I forgot that the battery, I need to repair the battery. The battery doesn't hold a charge anymore. So I got to do the Epsom salt and the uh, baking soda thing and repair the battery. And that will be done probably later this week. So I had to use the battery jump start. That didn't work. And then I used the battery charger. That worked. And that took 30 minutes. Too long. Then I finally got the truck started. I remember, oh, you remember that nail you drove over when it was snowing and got all that mud on the ground and you didn't want to take that tire off and all the mud and you said you're going to wait till they got dry? Yeah, you still got that nail problem and I thought the so-called nail tire was flat and it wasn't flat <sighs> worry me worry me worry me so now i finally get on over there to get me some water and i got the water and put the water in the containers and water in the containers put the lids back on to get back in the car and drove the car back all the way back home and parked the car and got out of the car and then took the charger off the car because there was a car in the truck you know and i took the charger off the car and i came inside and two hours had gone by it's now after seven o'clock it's trash day! And I was supposed to collect all the trash, get my... Because there's a bunch of boxes, empty boxes from all the deliveries from Amazon and so forth. And they've just been piling up because i just been taking them and said I'm going to reuse the box. And said, I ain't reusing nothing. So I took those empty boxes and I just threw them away. Cardboard, got to go. And that took another hour. But then I had a meeting with the spot trading people. Told the people, hey guys, there's been a lot going on this morning. A lot of distractions and a lot of things going wrong and usually when that happens it causes problems for me because I need structure routine so I said we're gonna get this done about 30 minutes it took another hour but we're gonna get it done in about 30 minutes and then there was somebody who commented and they asked a question and they wanted to pay attention explain everything that was going on and I just like I do my consults, I say, excuse me, hold on. And then I started telling them what they needed to do. They thought that I didn't understand their situation. They said, well, let me finish. Excuse me, let you finish. This is not your platform. I'm appreciative that you understand that somebody has to let you do something on their platform, but no, you don't get to interrupt me. Not here. Ladies and gentlemen, I don't tolerate it that person got upset not upset and irate to the point where they disrespected anyone they just got upset and that's okay peace out because I don't care I don't care if we're in a group setting and I'm the moderator and I'm controlling that setting and you feel that you need to speak and say everything under the sun because you think that that's necessary when it isn't. I don't care. Ladies and gentlemen, let me explain what's necessary. I just told all the members of the organization that I gave money to to put into the system that they can have that. They can have those funds. No strings attached. They can just have it. They got into the system and there they go that's how they got started so they actually made a, at least a hundred dollars 
each one of them. Got nothing to complain about. Woo, doggy. Ladies and gentlemen, I ain't rich. But I tell you what, I brought in two more persons. Well, I could afford it now because by the end of the week, I will have made over $500 since I started three weeks ago. And so I brought in two more people, gave them 175 each. They don't have to pay me back. They, they kind of figured that already. Remember I told you how I used to be? You used to be? Yeah, I'm just saying used to be as in past tense, not for the fact that I've changed, but used to be as in past tense in the past. That you couldn't put your hand in your pockets when you were around me? If you did that, you wouldn't get to be around me anymore? Well, I ain't changed. You ain't changed? I ain't changed. So, I wanted to take the time to let you know that I am very, 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 very impressed with this platform and how it works. Spot trading. We'll offer probably one more. I can't keep doing this every week, so we'll probably offer one more group an opportunity. And then these guys are going to bring people in. And after this, if you want to be involved, I'll put you in touch. You know, I'll tell you what you need to do, and I'll put you in touch with the group and all that. But we're not gonna, I'm not going to do any more trainings. We have videos that are put up so people can go watch them. But I'm not going to do any more training uh, after this one because it's just too, too time-consuming. And it's not, well, you ain't getting paid for it anyway. It ain't because of the money. Aw, did, did I do that? Again, as I said, it it ain't about being paid for. It ain't about money. It's time consuming. All right. As I said before, and I'm about to end this video, uh, the two doggies are gone. Oh, my doggies are gone. And so I'm getting ready to take down the dog pen. No more dogs. No more dogs. I'll probably do cats, you know, because I got rodents. There, there are a bunch of ground squirrels and everything around here because this, this is the open plains, y'all. And so what you got to do in the open plains, you got to go, got to close it. And so we're going to close it with some cats. You know what I'm saying, Burn? All right, let me do this for y'all. Y'all have a good day. I just wanted to explain. Arrivederci.